saying that the pro-Israel owner of the Times of Israel newspaper, uh, he's backing Pete. homosexual mayor Pete Buttigieg. Yes. All right. And he's the money man behind this app. Yes. Are you, are you suggesting that the Israelis are, are influencing the election to have the Democrats nominate its first openly homosexual presidential candidate? That would fit in with values that are, agree with that. What happened last night is weird. And we've already pointed out there is an Israeli connection. Imagine that. There's an Israeli connection to the Iowa disaster last night. Well, the Times of Israel report that. I don't know. They might accuse me of being anti-Semitic for saying it. But the truth is there is an Israeli connection to the app that bombed last night in Iowa. But you're not allowed to say these things. Everybody's being censored now. By whom? The same people who are doing this stuff. Right. I mean, this isn't too hard to figure out what's going on. A coup, a takeover of the United States of America, unless we resist. Now, let me, I'll say one final thing about the takeover. I've warned the American people for years that if we did not repent as a nation, we would be taken into captivity mm. and made slaves. This is, we're witnessing it right now. Yes. We're about 80% into captivity right now. They're shutting down dissenting voices. They're censoring voices that refuse to go along with the agenda. We're deep into the captivity right now. We're losing our rights and freedoms and we're being taken over by a foreign power that is anti-Christ. The very people who crucified Christ are going to be our masters if we don't do something about it. 